Okay, so first question. A school has 400 boys and 500 girls. The probability that a boy is vegetarian is 0 0.1. Probability of a girl is vegetarian is 0 0.2. Estimate the total number of vegetarians in the school. So we want the total, and we know that boys are 0 0.1, and altogether there are 400 boys. So 400 boys times 0 0.1 equals, that's just place value, so 40. And if you think about the logic and that, the 0 0.1 is the same as a tenth. So a tenth of the boys, a tenth of 400 boys. If we do the same now for the girls, so the 0 0.2 on the girls and there's 500 of them. So 500 times by 0 0.2 gives us 100, and again if you struggle with that, 0 0.2 is 2 tenths, 1 tenth of 500 is 50, so 2 tenths is 100. So that's not answered the question yet, because the question said total, so the total if we add those together is 140. The second question is a little bit harder, so if we just take that, it says there are 10 prefects in the school, four of the prefects are vegetarian, so that's four out of the ten are vegetarians, and two of the prefects are chosen at random to have lunch with a visitor, show that the probability that they are both vegetarian is two-fifths. So the best way I can show this is through a tree diagram, and think about first pick, and then second pick. So, we could pick a vegetarian or not, and then if I picked a vegetarian, I could pick a vegetarian again, or not, vegetarian or not. That would just be all of the options. Now, the question says they are both vegetarians. Now, the only way we can get both vegetarians is by taking this path here. So, the probability of a vegetarian on the first go, we said already, is four tenths, and that was from up here. Four of them are vegetarians. Now, if you've already picked one of the vegetarians, there's only going to be three of those vegetarians left. And if I picked one out of the ten people, there's only going to be nine left. So this on the second pick, the, oh, there's only three out of nine that could be vegetarians. So that means I've got four out of ten on the first pick, and I've got three out of nine on the second pick. Now, if I multiply these two probabilities out, that's going to get me 12 out of 90. Now the question said, show that this is equal to 2 fifteenths, so 2 fifteenths, 12 over 90, if we divide by 6, is equal to 2 out of 15. Now if you can see that by dividing by 6, remember you can half it, first of all, to get you to 6 out of 45 and then divide by 3. Either way, you will eventually get to 2 15s. And that is it.